Hello everyone, Zane here and welcome back to my channel. In this video I'm going to show you guys how to make Hawkeye Sand and the Veteran Tree Sap high quality. With the rotation that I use for 4.2. So the rotation hasn't changed at all for these recipes. Even though the recipe is a little bit stronger, the rotation works just fine. My stats of right now is 544 CP. 1501 Craftsmanship, which is all you need, is 1500, and 1477 Control. That is with the new Matcha Food, which is basically superior in seafoods too in every way, with extra 6 CP and extra 30 Control. And you'll also be using the Cunning Tea as well. So, Storm Sap, Hawk's Eye, and Dust Glow at the Sand are the materials for it. Storm Sap can be gotten through the Namazu Beast Tribes once a day. You get up to three of them. Or six if you're about to rank up with them. Because you get, get an extra three uh, missions. Hawk's Eye is in the Night Steel Ore node at slot 7 at 6 p.m. in the Ruby Sea. Or 6 a.m. And Dust Glow Ether Sand is the new sand that is reductible from the new item in the Ephemeral Nodes, which has been added to all of them. So you guys will be able to farm these relatively easier than the others. Alright, so you're pretty much going to be using all high quality materials as per usual. Uh, to get the Hawk's Eye high quality, uh, the Almegan uh, gathering set you have should be enough, so you don't have to worry about making any changes to your gear. And of course, Dust Globe comes, high quality comes naturally. And because the frequency of, of these, you should be able to get some of those very, very easy. So, like I said, the macro is basically the same thing that I had from 4.2. So nothing has changed for the rotation. So let's go ahead and do this. Now, if you are going to be using this as a specialist, you can re uh, reduce the high quality materials needed. Because with the extra stack from the specialist rotation, it'll basically make up for the normal quality materials. You're just gonna have to tweak the macro to fit as a specialist. Alright, macro number one is done. Alright, and now we do the finisher. And there's a hundred percent. And there you go. And that was without my specialist soul crystal equipped. Because with that, I would have 1497. So that's pretty much all you guys need to know is how to make those items. So guys, that's pretty much going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you found this useful. Any comments, questions, concerns you have, please leave them in the comment section down below. I'll be more than happy to help you guys out with anything you guys need. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you are new for more Final Fantasy XIV Stormblood content. And as a reminder, make sure you hit that notification bell next to the subscribe button so you guys never miss an upload. So until next time, guys, may you forever walk in the light of Lord Bahamut. Take care, guys.